Happy Wednesday, everybody. Guys, life can be hard. And I think it's important for us to recognize that sometimes. Now, my life is going really well. In fact, as of today, I am no longer homeless. I move into my new home tomorrow. There's also a couple jobs I'm looking into, and I'm excited for my YouTube channel. For example, did you know that we got 100 views on this channel in the UK last month? Hello UK, I'm so glad you're here! Welcome, 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 welcome. We're getting close to 100 subscribers. And friends, you continue to be the best fan group in the world! I have a special video I'm gonna make for you guys once we reach 100. So anyways, when I say that life is hard sometimes, I'm not trying to say that bad things are happening to me. Because good things are happening to me. A lot of good things. So I almost feel guilty saying life is hard. So what do I do? Feeling guilty for feeling bad is a recipe for not so good things. Okay, as a first step, I slow my mind down. It's easy for me to think too much. I have all these notions about what I should be feeling right now, and the problem is they're not matching up right now with where I am. So just for a moment, let's let those thoughts go. And I ask myself, how am I? And when I do that, guys, I feel a little scared and alone. Why do I feel scared and alone? Well, that's a really scary question for me. <laughs> One that I can't fully answer for myself. But here's me grasping for an answer. I believe now is a time for healing in my life. And healing can be scary. Because in order to heal, I need to acknowledge that I have hurt. And I don't want to do that. I mean, I don't want to admit that I hurt inside. I want to pretend that everything's going great. But the truth is, I do have some hurts, and some of these hurts go deeper into who I am than I can clearly see right now. And I'm a little scared to dive in. So guys, if you ever feel scared, it's okay. But why do I feel lonely? I think I'm afraid to let anyone in. I need to let someone in, because I can't face these things alone. I need a spiritual guide. I need to pray, too. But I'm afraid to. Because once I do, I know that I'm gonna start facing my hurt with them. And I don't want to face my hurt. I want to hide, close myself off, pretend that everything is okay. So guys, if ever you feel these things, know that you're not alone. I don't have magic words to make everything better. I wish I did. But here are a few words that I'm telling myself that hopefully someone will find helpful. Hopefully I find them helpful. I am not alone. There are others who have felt like this before and have grown. In fact, I've felt like this before. And the last time I came face to face with my hurt, Jesus, you guided me through it. And I remember how wonderful everything turned out. Jesus, I trust that you're working here. Help me to hear your voice. Help me to trust your guidance. I know you'll take good care of me, just like you always have. Jesus, help me trust. My dearest friends, I hope you have a great week. I will see you again next Wednesday. Let your friends know about me because once I reach 100 subscribers, I've got footage for an extended version of my most viewed video. You know, the human Sunday thing. And with that, God bless and ciao.